Hey, welcome back to. Hey, this. Hey, what's up, YouTube? Mr. Nocturne, I'm a fan here, and welcome back to um, Let's Play The Legend of Zelda Spirit Tracks. And this is episode 7, I believe. So, in the last episode, we possessed the phantom and got all the way up here. So, now we're gonna see what happens when we go and get this. We got a forest rail map. Oh, cool, we got more place. Okay, that's nice. I guess. Okay, some of the spear tracks are back. Okay, so we got some of the spear tracks back. Um. Okay, I'm guessing we just got through a dungeon. So, I guess that's it. We're gonna take the portal back to the beginning and see what Andrian says. Here we go. Triggers a cutscene. Okay. In each of the four realms is a temple. Look, my dear, the closest one is here. But I think you. But I don't think you can make it to the temple as things are right now. The rail map has imparted energy to a length of the spear tracks here. But because of the Demon King's power, much of the energy was lost. So we can't go to Temple Zandrian? Not yet, but there is a way to restore energy to, to the rail maps. I'm going to ask my people to help you. Your people? Indeed, we are called the Locomos. We are servants of the spirits. They have entrusted us with protecting the temples and the spirit tracks. By playing our sacred instrument, we generate energy that powers the spear tracks. Sacred instruments? Yes, and the spirit flute you hold is one of them. This flute was a gift from my grandmother. It, I didn't know it had any powers. I'd only heard that it was something precious handed down from my ancestors. Yes, and it was I who gave it to your ancestors. But only under that condition that they protect the land for all time. Of course, back then, I didn't think things would take such a perilous turn. I'm glad that after all these years, it has found its way into your hands. I had no idea this flute was so important. My grandmother used to play it for me when I was a little girl. If I was sad or upset, the sound of this flute would make me feel better. But even so, I suppose its rightful place is with you, Angie. No, you too will need have need of it. Please take it with you for now. You must go find the other locomotives and restore the energy of the rail maps. Once you do, the spirit tracks will reappear. Go to the forest first, where you must talk to the locomotives. South of the forest temples is a sanctuary where you can find Gage. He will be able to tell you where to go next. Got it. Okay. What is she gonna give us now? I want something good, at least. Oh, a train. Exactly, we needed a train. Okay, that's good. There we go. This train is a symbol of the spirits. Please don't ordinarily run it around. In it. But these are no ordinary circumstances. In the, I'm sure the spirits wouldn't mind lending it to you. Thank you, Anjin. Okay. 
Okay, so I guess we're gonna go on a train. There's something strangely powerful about the room that you discovered. If you trace your stylus over the tracks, it will set a path to your destination. Go on and try it, Naruto. Oh, cool. It's no, I want to go all the way. Okay, I guess that's good. Just go faster. There's a tassel, castle right there, but we're not heading in that direction. So this is a lot easier than earlier when we were riding with all the trains. Okay, good. Okay, I don't know what to do. Okay, there we go. This works. So, um... What the heck? It, like glitched or something. I let go of it and it wouldn't stop. What the heck? Okay, this is going good. What the heck? I can't. There we go. There we go. There we go. <sighs> okay. Okay, well, I don't want to trigger a cutscene just yet, so I think we're going to end off this episode right here. So, um, see you next time, and let's play The Legend of Zelda Spirit.